can be a pretty anxious person. I'm especially anxious about large responsibilities I have, but for which I feel ill-equipped. When I first became a parent, I felt very ill-equipped. Though I love my parents dearly, I can't say that I would hold up my upbringing as a proper model to follow. And I had very little experience with young children at all, let alone raising them up in the way that they should go. Fortunately, I'm a child of God, and we can cast our cares upon our Lord because he cares for us. That's what it says in 1 Peter 5, 6. As a young father, I prayed that God would show me the way and open up opportunities for me to learn to be a godly father. My prayers were answered in many, many ways, and I've been very blessed to learn so much from godly men, fathers, and mentors along the way, and to help the family of faith to train up our youth in the way that they should go for around 15 years now. Now that my youngest is graduating high school and starting the next leg of his life journey, I feel God leading me to keep praying for the families in our community and especially for the fathers. Everyone knows that mothers are vital to the development of children, and to be honest, they're oftentimes smarter and more resourceful than us dads, no offense guys. But fathers play an incredibly important role as well, and starting this fall with your prayers and support and with help from my friends, including Mr. Rick Wirtz of the Faithful Fathering Initiative in Texas, I'll be leading young dads in dad-specific Bible study groups to help support them with tools, information, and community to support them in their vital family leadership role. The motto of the Faithful Fathering Initiative of Texas is engaging dads in raising a godly generation and reinvigorating the church on the fathering front, and we're on board with that. If you're a dad, soon to be dad, or even a grandpa, won't you join us on this journey? You can text or call me, Bill Moore, anytime at 713-557-1204. See me in church or shoot me an email at wmore one at comcast.net. Blessings and peace to you, brother, in Christ Jesus our Lord.